So you were his girlfriend? Man. Yes. Unless I was, the relationship. which I don't even wish to be, and I can never even be. I was. Oh, what? I went to the house. And no, I didn't have anything. Please, I'm not begging for a man. So hello guys, welcome back again to this channel. If you're joining us for the first time, please don't always forget to subscribe to this channel and also press the post notification bell so that anytime I post my juicy analogy, you don't miss out. So guys, last night marked the end of uh, the Big Brother Niger reunion and of course it was the best uh, reunion ever. We didn't see any fight. But then uh, we saw something that actually the major highlight of the show, that is Emmanuel denying that uh, they were not into a relationship with Lee Cross. So guys, how did all this started? Uh, we saw a booker asking housemates, you know, their views and uh, you know, everything pertaining to the show and also he has something to do with uh, uh, who was the most strategic uh, housemates in the house, who came with a script in the house and definitely we saw some of the people saying that it's white money and almost everybody was saying white money and then he asked Queen uh, about uh, who was the most strategic and then Queen did not answer uh, that question instead he went and attacked uh, white money by saying that white money you know was a nice guy in the house and this man blocked him after leaving the house and guys white man was saying that uh, you know he was a he was a nice guy in the house and he told people that you know when you'll be calling me I'll always be there to, to receive your calls and uh, we will be interacting and of course he said that I uh, didn't deny he didn't actually he denied that uh, he didn't actually blocked Queen but Queen was went ahead and said that you know white money blocked me and all sorts of things you know I don't know what happened and it became a different person he allowed his fans to influence him next thing I started seeing screenshots started sending me screenshots of some people from his family is calling him names horrible names and I called him he didn't pick I sent him a text he read it and blocked me so when he blocked me, I was really hot and I was really angry and I blocked him back everywhere. I made my decision that I will never, ever talk to him again. I remember a student in this house. I'll be very caring and looking after everyone and everything. But chairman, when we leave this house, person will call me. I will get there for him. And then again, it went to the issue of Pere and Tega. <clears throat> Now, we all remember the issue concerning uh, the game that was in the house between Cross, uh, Pere, and Boma. And when Boma, or Pere was asking him, why did you tell us that uh, Tega's blah 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 was smelling like fish, you know? And then Tega was saying that I tried to reach out to Pere after we had left the house to tell Pere that. Uh, now, she was there narrating that uh, she told uh, Pere to go to social media again and retell the story again that uh, it never happened and such questions were never asked. And Pere actually told her, uh, uh, Tega, that you know, I can never do that again. I did it. Likely, Pere didn't do it again because he, he told Tega that you know, he can never do it again because he was not part and parcel of all my Tega issues. So that actually annoyed her. Uh, Tega and Tega was so mad at Perry as we can see from the video. I didn't want to insert myself into the Boma Tega drum at the time. Okay. Did you I beg you! Tega, even if I had come out to say it was a game, of course it was a game, everybody knew it was a game. Why didn't you just the, say No, Tega, Why didn't you, just you already say? had, you already had, you already had an yes, issue. Why didn't you just say that? You already had an issue yourself. that... Do you know what you no. said? Someone's to go to your comment and tell you, you smell like fish. So yeah, that was not the issue. That was not the issue that, that was affecting you. No, that was what was the affecting issue, you. No. So yeah, that's the what issue, affecting The issue that was affecting you was the perceived notion that you, as a married woman, according to, you know, had something to do with Boma in the house. Now, aside that, the major highlight of uh, the reunion was the moment that uh, Emmanuel denied the fact that he was in a relationship with Lucas. And of course, guys, remember after these guys had come out of the show, now the top five, uh, there, was a, there was an interview between uh, Emma Rose, Emma Rose ship, you know, with Toke Makino. And Toke Makino asked uh, Emmanuel, are you guys dating? Guys, kindly watch this video. The oh, yeah. Why breathing very hard? Mm -hmm. Okay, so are there any real feelings in there? Of course, yeah. She's an amazing person. I mean, I don't know if um, I fall in love with her beauty, but then her personality.
Alex as well. She is amazing. As you in love? You are in love. We are in love. You are. Mm. Now we know that Emmanuel denied uh, that uh, these guys I mean, they were not dating and they didn't know anything that existed like Emma Rose ship. You know, it was just I was surprised, guys. This is the biggest ship in the history of Big Brother Niger, as you know, Emma Rose ship, where people actually gifted these guys a lot of money with a lot of gifts. You know, before these guys embarked on the dating issues, you remember. Uh, Likoro said that uh, he, she got uh, into the room where they were spending with uh, Emmanuel only to find some lady in the house, in the room. So guys, I think these guys denied the fact that they were dating. But then I liked the fact that uh, Likoro came and said that, you know, they were dating. And it is so childish for Emmanuel to deny this thing in public. So guys, I'm here to maybe to highlight on some of the issues, of, you know, this is something that was existing. Everybody was, everybody knew that uh, there was a Maros ship and that is the ship that people wanted to win. And this man comes out, sit down publicly and deny that they were never in a relationship. So what do you think guys, whenever the big brother Niger starts, think carefully before you, do it, you donate your money on certain ships because now we have been beaten twice. So we have to shine and it continued guys where we saw cross and angel still settling the scores whereby angel was still claiming that our cross did not actually was not there for her and you know cross said that uh, i was there for you i was a good friend to you i called you out i called your mom we were really looking for you where you got where, whenever uh, where you were but we were not reaching you so if you feel that i did i was not actually caring for you it's okay it's not bad because I know that we were good friends. And again, we also saw the issue of Tega uh, also claiming that some of the housemates say that uh, she stole, you know, chicken in the house and she was actually telling these guys to go and denounce that in social media. Chicken. So you, you think Tega took the chicken? Just to clarify, because that's what was said in the video. Yeah. I saw the video. Yeah. So you think she took it? Sammy, don't say, I'm not joking, we're not friends right now. I'm very serious, we're not friends right now. And lastly, we also saw the issue of Beatrice saying that uh, she liked Perry so much when she came to the house and Perry was just there, you know, chuckling and giggling. Relationship drama. I like, I liked Perry from the beginning uh, and that we have, you know, I saw this fine, dark, tall, you know, guy, and I really liked him and something wanted to happen. I am I like? It wanted to happen okay, like that. So it was just three days, and this guy left me for another girl. She was right that something could have happened if, if I had gone there. So guys, that is what marked the end of this reunion and again we saw it uh, with a lot of apologies from other peoples and uh, you know it's something that uh, we are now looking forward to see the Big Brother uh, Niger Season 7 guys. Uh, so far so good, it was a good reunion guys. Let me know what you think about this issue of Emmanuel and Lick Rose on the comment section. Otherwise guys, let me see you in my next video which is dropping soon. Bye bye for now.